And when uh, the owners decided to get some vineyards in the Okanagan, they found this property was an orchard and they saw that magnificent old pine at the back of the property and it had stand there for ages through the weather, through the harsh winters, hot summers. For them, it was a sign of something that could hold through the, through the time. Le Vieux Pin is located on a black sage bench in the south of Okanagan, just about half an hour from south of Penticton. And the landscape is quite dramatic. It's mountains, valley bottom, and then lakes at the bottom. Here in the Okanagan, so we are going to work with the terroir that the Okanagan is giving us, with the climate, that cool climate, with the hot days and cool nights, and with the variety of soils that we have. And that's why we're able to have all those different expressions of the Syrah that we try in the Cuvée Violette, in the Cuvée Classique, and in the Quinox Syrah. It's a bit of a, like a painter that has his palette of color and then creates a painting. I'm a bit the same when I'm doing the blend, that is showcasing the different type of terroir and aromas that we are getting from all those different soils. The South Okanagan and the Okanagan Valley is basically a desert. It's the only desert in Canada and then starts in Washington State. The production of grapes is only possible in this valley because we have the lake. The lakes are allowing us to be able to uh, irrigate. We're going to try to not irrigate too much. We're going to irrigate just what's needed for the plant to produce the right grapes. We're not going to uh, deleave too much um, because we want to preserve the grapes from the sun. Just enough so that there's a nice airflow. There's a lot of wind in the valley and because it's quite hot, we're very lucky not to have a very high pressure with pest disease. And so we were able to turn our spray program and our farming into complete organic. When it's time for harvest, our field crew, they come every year, the same crew. It's really important for us to um, sustain the same people. That way they know how we work and then we have less training and then we have a more consistent work throughout the year. Philosophy behind the wines at Love Your Pain is really starts in the vineyard. If I don't have good grapes, I cannot make good wine. And everything is then harvested by hand in very small picking bins, brought to the winery and then fermented and aged separately until bottling time. And then we sit down as a team to taste all those different wines from all those different terroirs. The idea is to preserve Mother Nature as much as we can, to give to our kids the land that we got, and then to fully enjoy that passion, that passion that we have and that we give to you when you drink the wine.